Hmm. Good morning. Welcome to 815 Vinyasa Flow. Does everybody have a ball? So make your way to your mat. Just take off my, my jacket because I imagine we'll get a little bit warm. So take your tennis ball, throw my socks away, have my book for later. Has anybody ever read this book, Spiritual Graffiti? I know it's showing up to you backwards, but it is awesome. MC Yogi, it's a very easy way of understanding how spirituality really cha transformed MC Yogi's life. He's a friend, he's pretty amazing. Anyway, take your tennis ball, if you have one, I hope you do, and if not, you'll just rest for a moment and make your way onto your mats, lay on your backs, take your tennis ball, and bring it under your right glute, right under your cheekbone of your butt, and just lift up and start rolling around a little bit until you feel an area that is like, whoa, really doing it for you. And then stay there, let the ball stay there. Rest your other leg down, bring one hand to your belly, one hand to your heart, and sink into the tennis ball. I know some of you may be saying, this is torture. It's really not. Surrender yourself into it, right? We have all these areas in our body of tightness, and if we can just let ourselves breathe and let go a little bit, you may see this physical release happen right here, right now. So take a breath in through your nose. Breath out through your nose. And if all of a sudden it releases, feel free to move that ball just by moving your left cheek, your right cheek a little bit and find another spot. And breathe and sink. Don't worry, there's a method for my madness. My tennis ball actually has a word written on it. The word is adventure. And years ago, I read an article. Yes, I'm telling you a story to try to get you off of thinking about your tennis ball and your sensations. So St. Benedict's Prep, who I ultimately ended up meeting the head of school, um, I had an article in the newspaper many, many years ago about their soccer coach and how he had all of his soccer players write a word on a tennis ball that was inspiring and keep it in front of them so that when they were focusing on doing all these hard drills and everything, they could go back to that word. And I actually did that in a yoga class years ago, so I've got this leftover ball that says adventure. And it was really pretty cool. Okay, another couple breaths. No, we're not going to spend the entire 45 minutes laying on a tennis ball. And slowly exhale over to your left side. Release the tennis ball from your right cheek and just notice the difference between your two butt cheeks. Moving on now to the left side. Lift up, place the tennis ball and roll that tennis ball around until you find a spot that feels like it needs a little bit of TLC. Ooh, I found one. And then bring your hand to your heart and the other to your belly again and sink into that spot. Whoa, this one is a lot tighter than the other side. And breathe. Notice your breath. Are you breathing? Can you breathe slowly and deeply? Can you imagine you could fall asleep like this? Sort of like the princess and the pea when you can actually feel the pea under all the mattresses. Except now we've got this direct right here, right now. A 
couple more breaths. And again, if you don't have a tennis ball, no problem, you're lucky, you're just laying here resting, breathing, and you can try this at another time because we'll put the full version of this class on YouTube. Couple more breaths. Okay, lean over to your right side and lift up the tennis ball from your right cheekbone, put it aside, and just pause for another couple breaths, breathing in through your nose, breathing out through your nose. Set your intention for your practice today. Breathing in, pulling one knee into your chest and then the other. Give yourself a squeeze. Roll around side to side. And then bring your left foot onto the mat, cross your right ankle on top, and take both hands and press that right inner thigh out away from you a little bit, being very gentle below the knee. Keeping your right hand there, inhale, lift your left leg up, hold on to that left leg behind the thigh, pull the leg in towards you as you're gently pressing your right thigh away from you. Breathe. And then bring both hands underneath your left thigh, pulling the leg in a little more. Breathing. Exhale, lower that left foot to the mat. Inhale, straighten the right leg up to the sky, hold on as high up as you can, and exhale, just pull that leg in towards you, breathe. Exhale, release your right leg, inhale, bring that left ankle right across your leg below the knee, and then take both hands, press it, that left inner thigh away from you. Just feel the stretch, breathe. Keeping your left hand there, take your right hand behind your leg and pull that leg in towards you, breathing. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Doesn't have to be so firm, just very gently pushing and pulling and then taking both hands underneath your right leg and Pull that leg in, breathe. Feel the sensations, go with them, breathe through them. It's funny, sensation can be positive or negative, but then you think of the word sensational, right? Which has sensation in it. Slowly exhale, lower your right leg, foot to the floor, inhale, left leg straight up to the sky, flex your foot, and then reach your hands up your leg as far as they go. Exhale, pull that leg in towards you, breathe. Deep inhale, deep exhale. One more inhale and exhale. Press that foot back onto the mat. Bring your hands by your side. Inhale, lift up into a bridge. Breathe, very gentle bridge. And just notice how your glutes feel right now. Right, it's early to be doing this, except we just did some great warm up. Inhale your arms up overhead. And then exhale, release your hands back down by your side. One more breath in. 
exhale, slowly lower down, upper spine to lower. Straightening your legs out in front of you. Inhale, make your way all the way up. Good morning, hello, hi. All right, bring your hands behind you. Press your feet onto the earth. Inhale, lift up, lift up, tabletop breathing. And then inhale, walk one foot out in front. Stay on your heel for a moment. Just feel what that's like. Inhale, pull it back. Deep breath in. Exhale, the other foot out in front. Breathing. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Bringing the foot back in. Deep inhale. Exhale, slowly come all the way down. And I know it's early. Bring your hands behind your legs. Breathe in. Lift your feet up. So you've got your shins off the mat, parallel to the earth. Inhale, straighten your arms out in front of you. Modified boat. Squeeze your knees together. Breathe in. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. If you can, inhale, straighten your legs up to the sky. Deep breath in. Point your toes. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. And for all my Pilates friends, just turn your palms toward the earth. Lift up a little higher. Turn it into the teaser, since it was just World Pilates Day. Keep breathing. So imagine how many similarities there are in Pilates and yoga, with exception that the breath is so very different. Slowly exhale, lower down. Make your way onto all fours. Inhale, opening your chest. Exhale, rounding your spine. Inhale, opening your chest. Exhale, rounding. Two more. Inhale, open. Exhale, round. Inhale, open. Exhale, round. You should be feeling pretty loose right now. Inhale, your right arm up to the sky. Exhale, slide it under your left, hovering, hovering, hovering. Inhale, the arm back up. Exhale, slide it under. And one more time, inhale, lift the arm up. Exhale, slide it all the way under and rest that right shoulder right on the mat. Turning your head to the left, breathing. Inhale, your left arm up to the sky. Exhale it around your back, opening your chest, breathe. If you want, this is an option, stretch your left leg back behind you, breathe, and then inhale, slide it all the way over towards your right hand. Maybe you catch your foot with your hand, maybe not, it's okay, breathe. If you had your hand with your foot, slowly slide that leg all the way back, knees next to each other. Next inhale, lifting your left arm up. Exhale, press it back on the mat. Inhale, peel that right arm up. Good morning. Exhale, lower your hand. And other side, inhale the left arm up. Nice stretch. Exhale. Hover that arm underneath. Inhale, arm back up. Exhale, hover. Inhale, arm back up. And this time, exhale, come all the way down onto that left shoulder. Breathing. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Inhale, lifting your right arm up. Exhale, circle it around your back, giving yourself a little chest opener. Feel that. Same thing on this side. If you'd like, inhale, stretch that right leg all the way back behind you. You can start by tucking your toes. Feel your leg engage. And then slide the leg all the way around. Catch your foot with your hand. Opening your chest a little bit more. Breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Breathe. 
This feels so good. I think I could stay here the rest of the class. How about you? When you're ready, release your hand from your foot if you had done that and bring that leg all the way back, knees next to each other. Inhale, right arm up to the sky. Exhale it down. Inhale, left arm up, nice twist. Exhale, hand back down. Take an inhale, open your chest, tuck your toes. Exhale, downward facing dog. Pedal on your feet, breathing. And then taking your left hand, reaching for the outside of your right leg behind you. Deep breath in, exhale, look underneath your armpit. Pressing your right hand on the earth. Really feel the engagement, breathe. Exhale, release your hand. Other side, inhale the right hand outside of the left leg. Breathing, looking under the armpit, seeing what's going on up there. Breathe. Exhale, release your hand back. Pedal your feet a little more. Inhale, peel out to a plank. Deep breath in. Deep breath out, shifting forward, shifting back. Fingers spread wide, wrists, elbows, shoulders aligned. Thinking core, no stress in your wrist. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, back to your plank. Exhale to your knees, chest and chin sliding all the way down onto your belly, tops of your feet pressing on the mat. Inhale, come up into a little cobra. Breathe, shoulders release. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Tucking your toes, exhale, downward facing dog. And then walk your feet to your hands. Take your time. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold forward. Let yourself go. Start your inhale. Bring your arms out to the side as you come up one vertebrae at a time. Reach up to the sky. Exhale, hands to your heart. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Exhale, fold forward, forward bend. Inhale, half lift and step your right foot all the way back behind you. Exhale, drop your back knee. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Exhale, release your hands down. Inhale, left arm up to the sky. Exhale, release your hand. Inhale, straighten your front leg, go onto your heel. Exhale, fold. Breathe. Inhale, lift up. Bring your hands over to the outside of your front foot. Give yourself another twist. Inhale, come back. Bending your front knee. Inhale, lift your back knee up and go right into your plank. Breathe. Deep breath in. Exhale, knees, chest and chin, eight point position. Sliding onto your belly. Inhale, up into your cobra. Tucking your toes, exhaling, downward facing dog. Take a couple breaths here, deep breath in, deep breath out, deep breath in, deep breath out. So feel your heels working their way toward the earth. Breathe. They don't have to touch, it's just your direction. 
Next inhale, looking forward. Keep those hips high as you step your right foot forward between your hands. Exhale, drop your back knee. Go on to the top of your back foot if available. Inhale, your arms up to the sky. Exhale, release your hands. Inhale, your right arm up to the sky. Exhale, release your hands. Inhale, straighten your front leg. Tuck your back toes now for stability. Exhale, fold over your leg. And then inhale, lift up and exhale, bring your hands to the outside of your right leg. Just give yourself one more twist. Inhale, come back, bending your front foot, stepping your back foot next to your front foot. Exhale, fold. Inhale, slowly coming up, arms out to the side, opening your heart. Gazing at your thumbs. Exhale, hands to your heart. One more and we move on. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, half lift. Stepping both feet back into your plank. Exhale, lower down knees, chest, chin, or chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog or cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Three more breaths. So just for a moment, while you're in your down dog, press your right hand into the earth a little firmer than the left and feel that hand sliding away from you. And just feel that stretch for a moment. And then bring that hand back to neutral and do the same thing with the left hand. Really just press the left hand into the mat, sliding it forward. Feel like it's sliding forward. It's not really sliding forward. Breathing. Back to neutral. Now take both hands and feel that same action. Feel your inner elbows come toward each other and roll up toward the sky. Inhale, look forward. Your choice, lightly step, skip, or jump your feet to your hands. Exhale, fold. Inhale, come all the way up, arms up to the sky. Exhale, hands to your heart. Arms by your side now, press down on your right foot, breathe in, lift your left leg up. Circle your foot in one direction, breathing, deep breath in, gazing at something not moving. Inhale and exhale, circle the other way. Exhale, lower the foot. Other side, press down, breathe in, lift the right foot up. Circling the foot. Feel steady, circling the other way. And exhale, lower down. Big toes touching or close together. Deep inhale, bending your knees, arms up to the sky. Chair pose, Utkatasana. I don't know about you, everything feels so much easier after doing that tennis ball thing today. Exhale, fold forward into a forward bend. I just feel like my glutes are loosened up. Inhale, half lift, step into your plank. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, cobra or upward. Exhale, downward. Inhale, your right leg up to the sky. Exhale, step your foot through between your hands, plant your back foot. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Breathing, deep breath in. Working the outer edge of that back foot. Deep breath out. Palms together over your head and then bend at the elbows. Open your chest a little bit more. Breathe. Front knee over that ankle. Exhale, release your hands. Inhale to a plank. 
Exhale, lower. Inhale, upward facing. Exhale, downward facing. Inhale, left leg up to the sky, way up. Stepping your foot all the way through. Plant your back foot. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Same thing, palms together, bending at the elbows. Open up, breathe. Work the outer edge of that back foot. Everything is engaged in its own way. Breathe. Exhale, release your hands. Inhale to a plank. Exhale, lower. Inhale, upward facing. Exhale, downward facing. Breathe. Pedal your feet. Do what you need to do. Maybe just find your own inner and outer stillness. Or maybe you, you need to just have like a little movement meditation here. That's good too. Next inhale, look forward. Lightly jump your feet to your hands. And if you've never done it, give it a try. Exhale, fold into your forward bend. Inhale, bend those knees deeply. Arms up to the sky. Exhale, hands to your heart. Stay in your chair. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, twist to your right. Breathe. Knees even with each other. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, twist to your left. Breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. From here, stay with me. Inhale, step your right foot all the way back. Breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. And then exhale, bring your hands on the inside of your left foot. So bring your left foot out to the side of the mat. Exhale, drop your back knee. Top of your back foot, bring your forearms onto the mat if that is working for you and hang out for a moment. Maybe even open your left foot out to the side and breathe. From here, take your right hand, hold on to your left ankle. Bring your left arm behind you and maybe catch your back foot, opening your chest. Breathe. Exhale, release your hands. Come back up, open your chest. Inhale, lift your back knee. Slide your left foot back into your plank. And exhale, lower all the way onto the mat. Interlocking your hands behind your back. Inhale, lift your chest. Squeeze your legs together. Deep breath in. Deep exhale. And then turn into Shalabhasana, lifting your thighs with the next inhale. Breathe. Deep inhale. Your chest is like a telescope. It's going forward and up. It's not just going straight up and it's not just going straight forward. Protect your lower back. Breathe. Exhale, release down, making a pillow with your hands. And allow your hips to just sway side to side. Bringing your hands underneath your shoulders, coming up into your cobra with your inhale. Exhale, downward facing dog. Next inhale, step your right foot forward between your hands. Dropping your back knee. Bringing your hands on the inside of your foot. Slide your foot over to the side. 
and exhale, lower down. Breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Opening your knee out to the side if that works for you. I happen to think it feels really good. Just getting my watch on here. Okay, slowly plant your foot. Hold on to your right ankle with your left hand. Inhale that right leg, arm back behind you. Catch your foot and breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Exhale, release your hands. Slowly reframe your foot, lift your back knee. Inhale up into a high lunge. Exhale, hands to your heart. Take an inhale. Exhale, give yourself a twist over that right leg. Deep breath in. Exhale, step your back foot forward. Twisted chair. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Exhale, release your arms and just pause for a moment. So keeping things very efficient, just step your right foot to the right. Pivot your left foot, turn your right foot to the back of the mat. Inhale your arms out to the side and exhale. Bring your right hand down onto your foot, left arm up to the sky. Move into triangle pose for a moment. Breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. One more breath. And inhale, come up. Turn your feet to parallel. Exhale, hands to your waist. Take an inhale, open your chest. Lead with your chest as you exhale, fold forward halfway to start. And then bring your hands right onto the mat. Fingers even with your toes and your hands right under your shoulders. Take an inhale and exhale, fold toward the mat. Wherever your head goes, it's okay. Just feel like it's heavy. Breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Inhale, come up halfway. Take an exhale. Inhale your hands to your waist as you come all the way up. Take an exhale. Inhale, your arms out to the side. Pivot your left foot toward the front of the mat. And exhale into triangle. Lifting your arm up to the sky. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep inhale, exhale, release your hands on either side of your front foot. Inhale, lift up into a standing split. Exhale, step that right foot right next to your left, fold into your forward bend. Inhale, arms all the way up to the sky. Exhale, hands to your heart. Pressing down on your Left foot, breathe and lift your right foot up. Exhale up behind you, catch your big toe side of your foot with your hand. Inhale your left arm up to the sky. Exhale, dancer. I'm just feeling that this stuff feels just less effort today. Hopefully it does for you as well. Breathe. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Inhale, come up, release your hand, cross your right ankle over your left thigh, and exhale, sink. Hey, we did this in the beginning in a different way. Breathe. 
deep breath in. Maybe put your forearms on top of your lower leg. Deep breath out. Breathe. Maybe your hands come all the way to the ground. Maybe you hook your foot onto your left arm. Maybe you lean forward. Maybe your back foot comes off the ground, flying crow. Whoa! And slowly come back wherever you are. Inhale, come up. Exhale, release. We've got the other side. I know, all these surprises in store. Press down on your right foot. Breathe in, lift the left leg up. Catch the big toe side of your foot. Breathe in, lift your arm up. Exhale, dance. Dance your dance. By the way, today is Giving Tuesday now. And we just sent out an e-letter. We're really saying, give to food banks. Of course, you can Venmo us after the class, but do give to food banks today. Crossing your left leg over your right. Exhale, sink down, hover. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. And then slowly, maybe, your hands reach the mat. Maybe you curl your toes around your right arm. And then maybe you lean forward and lift off. Lift off, yay! And slowly come back, bringing your left foot next to your right. Hold on to opposite elbows. And make your way to a seat, straightening your legs out in front, sitting up tall, pull your right foot into the inside of your left leg, inhale your arms up, and exhale, give yourself a nice forward bend, Janus Sursasana, breathe, twisting over your left leg. Make sure you're breathing just because I'm not cueing you. I can't hear you. Inhale, come up. Exhale, release. Make your way onto your back. Plant your feet. Remember the bridge in the beginning? Bridge up. Take a breath in and rise up. Feel free to interlock your hands. Feel your shoulders coming toward each other. Pressing the sides of those interlocked hands into the earth. Feeling the engagement. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. If you're feeling good and feeling stable, inhale, lift one leg up. Doesn't matter which one. Breathe. Exhale, lower it down. So we're keeping our hips steady. Inhale, lift the other leg up. Breathe. A lot of times when we do these variations and we end up losing the integrity of the asana. So we try to keep it. Exhale, lower. One more breath in. Exhale, release your arms from underneath as you lower down one vertebrae after the other. One more, your choice. If you are practicing full wheel, feel free to do it. Otherwise, We'll do a whole class where we'll take you through stage by stage. So your choice, wheel or bridge pose. If you're doing the wheel, prepare and breathe in, rise up. Effortless 
plate. Breathe. Feel sensational. And feel good sensations. Breathe. One more breath. Exhale, slowly lower down. Take a moment. One hand to your belly, one hand to your heart. Slide your feet to the width of the mat and let your knees knock together. And just pause for a moment. From here, staying on your back, bring your knees up right over your hips, arms out to a T, or a goalpost, or a cactus, and exhale your legs over to the left, gaze to the right, Inhale back to center. Exhale to the other side. Inhale, come back to center. Let your legs float straight up to the sky for a moment. Feel your spine on the earth. Exhale, lower one leg down, planting the foot, then the other. Deep breath in. Exhale, slide your legs straight out on your mat and let your arms come in near your side body, flipping your palms up toward the sky so you can receive. I invite you to close your eyes moving into Shavasana, letting everything integrate, your breath settle, allowing the clarity that you gained in the last 45 minutes to just ripple through yourself. Everything slows down. Breathing, deep breath in, Slow breath out. And merge yourself with the, the essence of the beauty in this day right now. Let yourself become the clouds floating, observing, floating in such clean air. Find your beauty. It's there. Just like you found your glutes, it was there too. Taking your time, Begin to deepen your breath, letting your fingers and your toes gently move. Inhale your knees into your chest. Taking your time bringing yourself onto the side of your choice. And then making your way back up to a comfortable seat at the front of your mats. I'm gonna pretend that I can see everybody who's here. Allow your hands to float up to your heart center. I thank you so much for joining today. I hope that you enjoyed it as much as I did. Have a wonderful day. Namaste.